So inside of the GDXR Ultimate Template, we have a screen fade system built in. So if I put the headset on, even though it's super blurry, I had to reduce the resolution just so my computer doesn't crash. What we can do is we can go over to this teleport pad and when we step on it, we fade out and we see we've got an OpenXR load screen that is in front of our player. And to, to change that, it's quite simple. What you want to do is go to our VR underscore game instance. It's automatically displayed for us using this OpenXR load screen function, which exists inside of our game instance. And if we open this up, you can see that when we call it, we clear the existing load screen and then we add our splash images. So if you wanted to expand this, you can simply change the textures out, change their translations to the screen and their sizes, and you can just go through and add as many of these as you want. And that will allow you to customize the images that's actually displayed in the load screen. So I could select something like this. <laughs> and then if we jump in, I don't know which one this will change, but we can jump in and you can see that that's now updated the image to be what we want. So it's as simple as adding more of those and doing what you want with them. And then it'll actually run through as well, just when you load a level. So if you haven't seen that video, I recommend checking out the playlist and going from there. Cool. If you've got any questions, make sure to head over to the Discord. I can always help you there or drop them in the comments section below. All right. Bye.